guys, let's get a quick walk around on this 1972 Chevelle. It is badged as an SS. It's believed to be a true SS, but I'm not selling it as an SS only because there is no build sheet. If you know anything about these cars, all of the GM stuff, some of the years get really, really hard to tell what's a true SS or 442. It can't be done by the VIN number. It is strictly by the build sheet. And 72 is probably the most complicated year of all of those, uh, being that SS and uh, 442 were just trim packages. So with that being said, this is what she is. All the signs are there. SS grill, badges, rally gauge pack on the inside, steering wheel, door badges, all that stuff. We'll cover it when we get into it. But for now, let's take a look at the paint. Really, really good looking car. Nice paint on this car. Car gets driven or was driven. So it is not perfect. There's some chips there. This is probably the absolute worst spot. Um, it can be fixed with a little touch up and some clear. But other than that, really, really solid, even down in the rockers. Uh, there's a couple of chips here, here, that type of thing. Really nice chrome on this car. Shines really, really well, as well as all the other bright work on the car. Mirrors, window trim, the vinyl top is gorgeous absolutely rock solid everywhere you touch I went around this top probably four times looking for any signs of deterioration and the only thing I found was right here there's the slightest bubble right there uh, about an inch and a half but if you press here absolute rock solid i think that's just where the trim mounts are Them things gather rust the same as uh with the trunk trim and that type of thing on these gm cars but let's jump into the interior as i said all the signs are there Floor mats obviously weren't from the factory, but steering wheel, rally gauge pack. Um, this one has Dakota Digital. It's been upgraded to Dakota Digital with Vintage Air as well. I will tell you that this ashtray falls down from time to time. I'm looking for another one and will replace it. If not, you'll need an ashtray. Bottoms of the doors are gorgeous on this car. So are the cab corners. There is an aftermarket radio right there under the dash. So it's got speakers sitting behind the seats. Nothing in the package tray. They left, they left the car unmolested. If you'll notice the photos in this car, those doors shut up, really jam up. Um, but the uh, videos on the inside of the car are darker than normal. And that's because this car is tinted all the way around. I do not know the percentage of the tint. It also has a slightly tinted windshield. Very menacing look coming down the road. I probably driven this car a total of 10 times nothing but thumbs up and that's from the cops and everyone else so to your discretion nice solid interior excellent dashboard a little spot on the end of that theme carries over and you'll see 
we're gonna put this thing on the lift. We'll crank it up. We're gonna do all that cool stuff. But this one's a nice one, 1972 Chevelle. All right, so let's take a look up underneath the hood. The actual metal is gorgeous. It's got some chrome accessories on the 350. Runs, drives, sounds good. March pulley setup, vintage air. That all looks really nice, red top battery. Core support is all nice. We'll fire this thing up. And I will tell you, now this car has probably been sitting here. It hasn't been moved since last night. This is just one of those cars. On the coldest of start, one, maybe two pumps of the gas, but 90% of the time, and I'm willing to bet my video on it, quick look up underneath this Chevelle. Really nice, really solid. This is my first time up under here. Came into the shop and they had it on the lift and you never waste an opportunity. Front and rear floor pans are excellent. On the passenger side, frame is gorgeous. Front and rear floor pans the same on the driver's side. And so is the frame. It's really nice. 1972. Right, so let's get a look inside the trunk. As you can see, deck lid's absolutely perfect. That is blue, but trunk seams, quarters all that good stuff super nice 